All right, YouTube. Man, this this year ain't been fun at all, you know, especially near the end of it. In fact, all 2020s has sucked. All three years, really. <laughs> I don't know what to tell y'all. It's just so much things happening. Monkey see, monkey two effects, and I don't know. Um, we got Croker Butt on the bed. He's on some clothes right there. That little black fluff back there. <laughs> So what really got me in the mood today? You, you'd be like, well, Mike, you got your horror pack. Shouldn't that be um, pretty good? Well, it's kind of something they've done that I'm just not for. You know, I understand uh, the reason for them, Diego and the crew, but... Oh, my God, you know. I mean, eight years strong, right? I've only missed horror pack, you know, because I didn't know about it. In fact, I was looking to switch over from something. Nerd Block used to have uh, many different type of blocks, and, and horror was one of them. They ended it uh, a couple months after I kept looking for some I could maybe go into, and I just didn't find stuff I liked, you know. Well, finally, I found something that was really a fantastic deal. Eight years strong. I think they only had one price hike at a time from um, 15 to 20, which that's, that's fine by me. They had their own little horror um, team up with Rue Morgue, which was pretty awesome, but that lasted for like maybe a few months and then that partnership fell through. Um, well, it's not even fell through. It's just things just got costly and getting different items here. It just was too much to handle and they had to focus on their own stuff, you know. Room work. I mean, I used to love collecting their stuff. Um, they had a partnership, I think, with Nerd Block at one time, and um, Nerd Block, like I said, did some scummy things. They weren't paying their partners, and that fell apart. They disappeared. They claimed they were gonna come back, but I guess they scammed their newer partners. And <laughs> Loot Crate is still there, but I mean, the stuff Loot Crate does, um, I'm not too into the anime crate they got is pretty great but everything else is under par to me you know I, I mean there's more I want from stuff um there was another uh, uh deal Dread Dread Central had their own little boxes and stuff it was pretty awesome but uh you could get some things autographed but the stuff I wanted I just didn't get in there always advertised as hey we got a fantastic hundred dollar a big extra box to go to one lucky subscriber. I would never win those things from anything. It just was pain in butt, and I don't know how they did the things about, but I don't know. It's just I felt like I wasn't getting my money's worth with a lot of stuff. But this, oh, I was getting my money's worth with a uh, horror pack, you know. And eventually things got uh, come to a conclusion or whatever a lot of people have unsubscribed um i'm pretty sure they're gonna lose half their uh, fan base because of this and they've done another price well i mean the last thing like i said was a while back but things do get costly i understand you know the yego and the crew they gotta get something out of this you know instead of constantly keep it at, at a fantastic price they gotta meet uh demand you know inflation gone up i mean pandemic's over with um they claim inflation done with but everything is going up still i mean it's not going down it's going even up so i understand but at the same time you pick that terrible time to do things in fact you did right after netflix um netflix the first subscription based stream service to go over twenty dollars you know lost their damn minds with that yeah, so we're going to get rid of um HBO Max just to, to, to make up, you know, just to, to, to keep up with how things go. I constantly had to cut things, you know. This month, I had to cut things. I couldn't get everything I wanted. Lords of the Fallen Collector's Edition, we had to get rid of. One of the NIST games of Fates, uh, we had to cancel. Um, I wanted some um, horror t-shirts. We had to cancel those um, because, not, you know, we had the Ultra Box from Pokemon come out. I tried to get some Disney Lacan and stuff that didn't meet the man. Um, other stuff came up. So, of course, Horror Pack got to go up, you know, a, a little they claim. The thing is, the box a little did go up, but the shipping and handling is just too much for me, okay? I'm not happy about that six ninety nine for shipping and handling. Hell no. I used to praise things they used to do free shipping, but now everybody's switching over, especially with pre-orders, you know, with games. Like, I don't understand that NIS. NIS was once thing I blessed, uh, praised them, and now we want money now for a game they may come out 
three or four months later or whatever and you know you got uh limited run games oh pay us now you may get this a whole year later <laughs> who wants to pay now to get something much later like this trash to me Ah oh, man, if if I had to do this video at the time he went ahead and said, I, I would have been cussing my tail. I would have had real negative stuff to say. You know, some days gone by because once again, this where where wherever the warehouse is to be shipped out, who whatever postal service this is does some trash stuff sometimes. They'll send this to maybe Memphis, Tennessee to come back down to. I live in Augusta, Georgia. Okay. From Atlanta to come to Augusta, I mean, it, sh it should be, makes sense, right? But to go from whatever thing to Atlanta, to go somewhere, come back to the same Atlanta thing, and send to be shipped out two days after, I mean, uh, what, what, what is, what's going on with Peachtree Atlanta? What, what's going on over there? Oh, Peach, whatever the hell, it's just, I don't get it. I should have been had this, maybe the same day to the next day after they made this announcement. Oh, this video would have been way worse. <laughs> that six ninety nine kills the deal. Okay, I mean, that's that's like a, a fifteen dollar price hike because we got to include pri uh, your, uh, your shipping and handling to whatever price you added. You know, so that's like ten dollars per. I mean, that, that maybe okay with some, but I mean, that kills a lot. You know, so. I'm gonna keep this for two months. So two months is already gonna be um let's see eighty dollars because it's now forty dollars. So twenty five dollars to forty dollars. So basically, for two months I'm missing one box or paying for an extra box that's not gonna come, and a five dollar tip. I don't know about that. So you got November and December to wow me. You got two months. You I mean. <laughs> If it don't wow me and we get the same stuff, I'm done. I'm, I'm just going to have to buy the horror pack exclusive separately on eBay or on your store uh, whenever a deal may came up or whatever. But it's too much. You're basically one of the last people who want to do price hikes. And it's just really a negative effect of um, the timing you did for it. Right after Netflix, right after we got a piss poor cola. In the same month, they announced a 3.2 cola that doesn't meet demand. Analysts say it's supposed to be a 4.2, 5 point. Everything else, I mean, the government uh, people got a 5 point. Um, food stamps got a 5 point increase. Uh, active duty, 5 point. And you give us a 3.2, that, that just pays for my increase of uh, auto insurance. Nothing else. Food is the most expensive thing going up, and you don't even factor that in. I mean, so much going on, you know. They picked a terrible time to do this. The president want more money to give to these wars uh, overseas after they he's done like four or five times already, and not give to the people who really need it. I mean, man, come on. Nothing against the wars or, or uh, um, the places there. It's just the fact, like I said, to come up with millions to billions and, and one of one point one, uh, uh, two trillion uh, a deal to send more money. What? And you tell us there's never no money for the uh, colas, the, the seniors, the elderly, the disabled vets. And here you can instantly find money and ask for money and take from other programs to give. Um, I, I don't get it. I don't. All right. So let's just jump into this, okay? Like I said, you got November, December to wow me. I'm expecting collector's editions. I'm, I'm expecting steel books. I'm expecting limited editions. I'm expecting autographs. I'm expecting slip covers. I'm expecting something to come out this uh, uh, increase, because if you do like Netflix and um, what else they went up, uh, uh, something else they went up, and, and it's not worth it. You're not giving back. They claim, oh, it's for our funding for do our studios, but yet you're taking away, such as your animation uh, studios. What? It makes no sense. Oh, PlayStation. That's what you wanna uh, already charge for something we're doing. Okay, online. We 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 pay for online services. Now you want to charge us to play online on PlayStation and Xbox? What? And you done a price increase that's way more than it should have? What? That's coming up for me. I got to renew that soon. But I mean, like, everything was to go up crazy. But yet we don't get a, a wage increase or anything. Well, you know, I'm disabled, but I, I get everything from that. But anywho, Let's check out what we got in this box, all right? Before I just lose my mind and then I start cussing, okay? But I'm not happy. I'm not a happy camper about that. 
So you got November and December to wow us. <laughs> I got I subscribe. I'm sorry. You, you, you got too costly. It's the shipping and uh, handling that did it, you know. I don't mind the extra, you know, uh, 34, I guess, from a 25, but. Well, it's not even 34, it's 32, maybe. I, mean, I don't want to do that, okay. <laughs> now let's see what's in here. So basically, we got October. They got a routine for last year's October, which was pretty down bad. Probably one of the, 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 the lower type of that year, because the, the year was pretty good. In fact, this year was pretty good, too, but. The October, I mean, horror, October, scary, spooky, goes hand in hand, right? Let's see if they can redeem. Well, off bat, I don't see no steel books, no slip covers. Um, there's like two little gashes on the back of this. Uh, uh. All right, let's see what we got. Well, they got another paranormal activity, the Ghost Dimension, a new unrated. Um, if this, I'm gonna show you why this time. Let, let this. Bam! I got this for like thirty dollars, plus a coupon. From eBay when they had their little Prime Day. And the reason I had to get this is because there's one movie that's only in this and they're not going to do separately. So, ha. Ah. I haven't even opened this up yet, but uh, we got rid of the, the two that uh, the Horror Pack sent. Because, um, like I said, I, I got the uh, box set now. So, we put that in the duplicate section. Ah, so, this makes this a duplicate. This is going to go into the, the duplicate thing. Um, not looking good. Maybe for y'all who just starting out. But already October is not looking straight. You're not redeeming. <laughs> Alright, it's just a... Uh, no. Nah. So we got a uh, spell. Evil has its roots. I think I've seen this on uh, Amazon. There's a lot of things I hold back because I never know if a horror pack going to put it out. Looks kind of interesting. All right, it looks interesting. So this is going to definitely be a blind watch. Yes, pretty awesome. Don't have it, so anything I don't have looks awesome. All right, just a horror pack one, and let's see here. We got a Disturbia. In fact, there's some weird stuff going on with this packaging on here. There's some minor little scratch gashes on here I got a not so great copy right here right here we got Disturbia I don't know if you can see it through the glare like you can see like up here there's like a little small guy you can see it right there but it's like all over the packaging you don't see it that well on there all right so we got Disturbia I don't have it in the collection so that's two for three uh four right now it's my stomach. I haven't eaten today, so if you hear that little growl, I apologize about it. I'm just hungry right now. Oh my! I just got this, so we wanted to lock this out. And that's pretty good and awesome right there. And for our horror pack, we got number 88, Obstacle Corpse. Since they're saying Obstacle Corpse, we got Obstacle Corpse. Not a so great uh, cover, you know, kind of um, disappointing the cover look, but I mean, anything that's a blind watch and I don't get is awesome, you know. Most of the time, the horror pack exclusive does that, so that keeps me happy right there. Uh, let's see what, I mean, you can see a little bit of that back, and they running a little course itself, so something's going on there. So I had to say three out of four is pretty fine. Um, this was disappointing because I guess, you know, y'all want to, I guess, push, you know, it, it once you don't have, you know, but I mean, there's so many out there, but I bought the box set. This is completely useless to me, you know, so do I have to say it's still a pretty good month, but it's definitely the lower one out of that. Once again, they've let me down for uh, October. They should have went big for October, Halloween. So that's two in, two years in a row now you've let me down. 
you know, maybe it looks good for y'all who just starting out or whatever, but like, I expected something better. I expected a slip cover, steel book, limited edition, collector's edition, autograph, something. October. A horror month for a horror pack. This is your month. And it was one of the lesser months you've done for this year. You've let me down. You've increased the prices. <sighs> so disappointing this year to spend. Oh, man. I expect at least, you know, to, if you're going to give out this news, this box was going to be fantastic at least. I mean, like, last month, did we have a, a we had slip cover either last month or, or the month before, you know? So I expect. I don't understand what 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 you're doing with the October. I mean, like, you just do you be like, hey man, it's a every day for every uh, month. We don't celebrate, we don't celebrate holidays or something. This is what's your month, and I just felt like you let us down. And like I said, if you're still releasing the same type of stuff on um, for November, December, I will have to cancel because that price increase killed everything for me. You know. I got to make do with everything else that price increased. Um, and on top of it, we got charged for your new... Uh, uh, we had to, like, cancel and, and start a new subscription. So not only did I get hit with the October price earlier, um, because uh, every 13th of the month you get uh, charged. So instead of getting charged for next 13th, we've already got charged in the same month. So that's twice. I, you know, I like to factor in my... my um, Whenever I get my disability check and see what I have and what I can do for that month, I am now forty dollars in the hole. Yeah, because I couldn't factor in that. I don't know. I don't know what to tell y'all, man. Like I was already in a bad mood, but I mean, three movies out of four is fine. But I mean, ah, shit. Thirty dollars, like thirty. What's what I said? Well, whatever I paid for was much less than what they usually went, because usually this thing went forty, you know, when they did a price drop. But now it didn't even price it, because they gotta get this stuff out of uh, Amazon warehouses. <sighs> this month, this month. Anywho, regardless about my bitching, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave some likes, some comments. Definitely hit that bell to subscribe, and always enjoy.